Bottle top Bill and his best friend Coffee up on the hill. Let's watch them as they play. Right, Corky. What's it going to be about? It's all about walking the dog. Great. What a lovely, lazy day, Bill. Just right for doing nothing, Corky. And it's just right for sitting outside in the sunshine. Great idea, Corky. What's wrong, Bill? My legs are stiff, Corky. What you need is exercise. What sort of exercise? Watch me, Bill. Here goes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That exercise looks like hard work, Corky. That's the idea, Bill. <laughs> Hello, Mrs. Whistlehead. Hello, Bill. Hello, Corky. Can you help me out? Sure, Mrs. Whistlehead. What is it? Timmy needs his walk, but I have to go into town. Could you take him? It'll be a pleasure, Mrs. Whistlehead. Just leave him with us. Wonderful. Right, out your hop, Timmy. He really needs his walk. He's been eating too much food lately. I won't be long. See you soon. My exercise will have to wait, Corky. Taking Timmy for a walk is exercise, Bill. You're right, Corky. We can do the two things together. Let's go, boy. I think Timmy wants to go anywhere, Bill. How can we take him for a walk if he doesn't want to walk? We need an idea. What sort of an idea, Corky? Watch. A toy car? How will that make Timmy walk? You'll see. We just add a bowl of dog food. Timmy loves food. If we make the food move, then Timmy will move too. <laughs> Timmy, come on, boy. Right, Bill. Stand by for some exercise. Okay, Bill. Ready to go walking? Ready, Corky. Then let's go. <laughs> Oops. I didn't mean to make it go that fast. <laughs> oh, do something, Corky. Make him slow down. Will do, Bill. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Timmy, stop! Timmy! Corky, help! Let go of the leash, Bill! Good idea, Corky! Good work, Bill! Watch out for the big slide! I can't stop! Oh dear! Bill's heading straight for the pond in our garden! Alright, Corky. Just so good and proper. I'm sorry, Bill. No worries, Corky. At least we got Timmy to do some exercise. Where is Timmy? He's not at the slide. Or the bus stop. Or the bush. Uh oh. He hasn't run away, has he? I think he might be getting too much exercise. We'd better find him, Corky. Or Mrs. Whistlehead will blow her top. We'll head for Watermelon Mountain. Good idea, Bill. There goes Timmy Corky. I think he's too fast for us. Let's take the shortcut, Bill. Good thinking, Corky. Jump on. <laughs> we'll catch him in no time. There he is, Corky. Grab hold of the leash, Bill. Will do. <laughs> Missed. Now where's he going? We'll just have to follow and find out. <laughs> Looks like a big road. And there's a building too. Lots and lots of buildings, Corky. That means he's going into town. <laughs> I hope Timmy doesn't upset any people. How could he do that? There's all sorts of people in town and they've all got business to do. Very important business. Right. Can you see Timmy yet? Not yet. There he is. He's heading straight past the fruit man. <laughs> 
I'm Fruit Man. I can't see a Fruit Man. Corky, watch out! Hang on, Bill! <laughs> I can't see Timmy anywhere, Corky. You're facing the wrong way, Bill. OK. Now, where's that Timmy? There are so many buildings around here. He could go into any of them. Up ahead, Bill. He's going into the museum. Well spotted, Corky. Let's get after him. We'll have to be careful in here, Corky. A museum is a very special and precious place. I've never been in a museum before, Bill. What's it like? It's fantastic, Corky. You can see all kinds of things in a museum. What are all these bones? That's a skeleton, Corky. It's a dinosaur skeleton. Wow! This dinosaur's missing a leg bone. And I think I know who took it. Timmy. Timmy. We've got to find him, Corky. And the missing leg bone. What's this room, Bill? I'm not sure, Corky. We'll have to find out. Look, there's a pyramid. And a statue of a very special king. Wow. What are these things, Bill? They look like they're all from ancient Egypt, Corky. Do you think we'll find Timmy in here? Let's hope so. Bill, look. There's another statue. It's a cat. The Egyptians love cats. <laughs> Timmy, where are you? Look, Corky, over there. The dinosaur bone. But where's Timmy? We better put this bone back. But Timmy's getting away. It's okay, Corky. You watch. Perfect, Bill. I knew my frisbee practice would come in handy one day. But where do we find Timmy? <laughs> What's out there, Corky? It looks like a courtyard of some sort. Why is Timmy going there? There's only a few plants. There's more than plants, Bill. I can see a cat. A really big one, too. And he's not alone. Look at all these cats. What are they doing here? I don't know, Corky. I think I know why they're here. Why, Corky? It's a cat show. A cat show? I think yeah. you're right. I see lots of cats, Corky, but I don't see Timmy. Bill and Corky. Mrs Whistlehead, what are you doing here? I'm a judge at the cat show, but what are you doing here? Uh, just looking at the cats, Mrs Whistlehead. Then where, may I ask, is my Timmy? <laughs> Timmy, what are you doing? It's all right, Mrs Whistlehead. It's all under control. Got it, Corky. Oh, hang on, Bill. Oh, 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 oh. I've got you, Bill. Oh, oh. <laughs> what are you doing to my Timmy? Whoa. <laughs> Whistlehead. We were only trying to give Timmy his walk. But he didn't want to go. So we had to trick him into moving. 
But you know, I do believe Timmy's looking thinner. <coughs> yes, indeed. You have lost weight, haven't you? <coughs> well, Bill and Corky, I don't know how you did it, but you actually got Timmy to do some exercise. Well done. Thanks, Mrs Whistlehead. Would you like us to take him home now? I think you'd better. I have a very large mess to clean up. We can stay and help, Mrs Whistlehead. Thanks for the offer, Bill, but you've done more than enough already. We'll see you soon, Mrs Whistlehead. Thank you. And please say sorry to all the cats for us. Meow. I think you'd better tie Timmy's leash to the tree, Bill. We don't want him to get away again. Good idea, Corky. Make sure he's tied properly. Ruff, ruff. No more ruff. chasing cats for you, Timmy. I think Timmy's so tired from all his exercise, he's not going to go anywhere. And I'm so tired, I'm not going to go anywhere either. I wish my legs weren't so stiff, then I'd be able to relax in my chair too. Maybe after all the exercise you've done, your legs won't be stiff anymore. You think so? Why don't you give it a try? Well... Go on, Bill. See if you can sit in your chair again. OK. Here goes. Brilliant, Corky. My legs aren't stiff anymore. From now on, Bill, I think we should exercise every day. That's a top idea, Corky. But right now, I think we both deserve a good long rest. <laughs> when you're right, Corky, you're right. Oh, <laughs>